So, hello guys, and welcome to this new video. Today we are here for the find and replace filter. Um, this functionality was already kind of possible with the advanced tag 1.0, but it was it requires you to fill in a lot of options and stuff, which was a bit annoying, I think. And also the advanced tag 1.0 was written when I had way less knowledge of how filters work and stuff. So, uh, yeah. Uh, 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 this one is, has been written in a way more, well, reliable way, I think. So uh, let me just show you the setup I'm going to be using to prove this, how it works, that it works and stuff. So uh, we've got insert level var1 key, that's the custom name of this hopper. Uh, and here we got uh, a bunch of items with custom names, like this one. And just to prove it also works with entities. I'm going to drop some items here and their names should also be changed. Now, I think that's going to be about it, so let's see you right in MC Edit. We are in MC Edit. Uh, let me just grab the selection. Um, I mean the setup with the selection. Now we go to uh, Find and Replace. As you can see, no input strings here. Uh, I learned some stuff about, well, filters. Like, I'm, I'm always still learning, even after about a year of filter writing now. And, uh, yeah, I figured out how you can like basically define the default value of the, these fields, which is quite nice because in my opinion, the input string here is really annoying to work with. So now you don't have to remove anything. However, if you just fil run a filter like this, it will give a, an error. Anyway, let me just uh, replace that for one I showed you with something else like for two, you would probably use some uh, yeah, actually like a number something concrete. Of course it also works with command blocks which would probably be its main functionality uh, for most people but I'm just um, using the setup to show it here. Anyway guys, uh, we run that filter I think and it worked so let's see you right back in Minecraft. So here we are back in Minecraft and let me just show you as that everything has been replaced so far one becomes far two same thing over here, and also the items should have been changed. So yep, we got var2 key now. Okay, uh, so yeah, that uh, shows how it works, that it works, that kind of stuff. Uh, so I think that's going to be about it. Um, there will be more uh, filters upcoming about stacking and advanced stacking uh, in the next, well, I don't know, maybe month. Uh, soon, let's just call it soon. Um, so yeah, I think that's going to be about it. Thanks for watching. Uh, I hope you liked the video, but even if you didn't, just leave a rating. And I hope I will see you in another video.